This is Kirk Wiley. We're at the QCon party and hear some stuff to say about Bamboo. So, Bamboo 2.2 just got released this week. I'm really excited about it. Uh, in addition to having five things fixed that I was directly responsible for filing, which I think is a really great thing that I can track something all the way from the point at which I request it to when it's being released, the big thing is Amazon EC2 integration. And this is a game-changing thing. So I'm going to make this guy my special correspondent, I think. If you have build conditions that you only want to run overnight or that you don't want to have to build out the infrastructure for, instead of having to grab one of your other dev instances, the build system will actually launch your EC2 instance, run your continuous integration task, and then shut it down at the end, meaning that you don't have to ask for a whole host of machines or a whole host of VMware instances or a whole host of anything else Beautiful. just to run the things that you just want to test every now and then. So it means that especially if you're dealing with a Unix type environment, you actually can test Solaris x86, Ubuntu, Kubuntu, Fedora, RHEL, everything else, and not have to worry about bothering your IT staff to develop all of that. And they just released Windows support, so you can do that as well now. And now Fantastic. Windows as well. Game-changing technology. They're the only people that I know that have it. And although I'm a big bamboo partisan, it is completely game-changing compared to anybody else in the market and I've been following the progress and they've learned so much about doing it and actually some of the more interesting stuff is how much they've learned about how complicated it is to do that kind of rapid application development using the C2. Fantastic. Thank you, Kate. You're welcome.